tell me the story from the beginning. The time when your team from AFM came to Zambia here around December to January, you taught us indeed about life in Jesus Christ. Hi people, I'm Pastor Ephraim. Here where we are, we have a church that has just started. The first time it began was when the people from AFM visited us here for evangelism. So about a year and a half ago, um, myself and a small team, we came out here to Luangwa Fera, Luangwa Bridge for the first time. And while we were out here, the Lord, he was moving. He was moving in signs and wonders. There were salvations. But during that time, there was actually four specific families that came to know the Lord. And little did we know, that during that time they started to meet together and they began to meet just behind the tree um, that's just behind me there. Having known that they were just wasting time to sit around in the village, they realized that Christ Jesus was uh, very important for their lives. They realized that it was important that they continue worshiping the Lord. So they came with an idea of finding a place where they can be gathering together for worship services. AFM came again a second time on, in the other year. I had the opportunity to bring them here to see what the people were actually doing. We found these people molding bricks for them to build a church. They began to just put bricks together. So the last time that we came here, all that we saw was um, bricks. I think they had about 3,000 bricks that had been handmade and they had built the small kiln, the small place where they were gonna burn those bricks um, and just begin. And they actually put their money together so that they could make this foundation um, for the church and they could begin to build this building where they could actually meet together. This is the foundation that you see behind me here, which of which the, is the church that they want to, to build for now. Uh, this church here is one baby that we can say was born out of the Holy Spirit through the AFM, who came to encourage the people, who came to preach the gospel to the people, and the people received the gospel with, their, with both hands. And today, they are worshiping here. I have a great desire for Jesus Christ. I too have a great desire that this Christ will reign in this community where we are today. I have worked here for 24 years as a teacher. Therefore, this place remains a very, very, very big uh, attraction to my heart. I am here to make sure that I see this community saved and live for Jesus Christ. The main vision for which I am partnering with AFM and to work with them here is to ensure that this area is saved and is won for Jesus Christ. We want to have this place emerge as a center of salvation. We want to have this place emerge as a community development center a skills center where people will resort to coming as they are looking for the road and as they are looking for abundant life that Jesus Christ is able to provide for them. Yeah, so our heart as AFM um, partnering with Ephraim and people like Ephraim that just have just a burning heart for Jesus, for the community, for Africa. We have a heart to bring young adults from America, from different countries as well, um, that have burning hearts for Jesus. They're coming here, they're feeling called, so they come here, but while they're here, they're also being impacted um, by the Zambians as well. 
and by the presence of God as we're gathering together. We're being unified, not only as a team of Americans, but also as Americans and Zambians together, coming together in worship, coming together in prayer and intercession um, before we go out into the community and going out together as one team to preach the gospel um, in the community. So we're just believing that the Lord is bringing more Americans and more Zambians that we can work together for the cause of the gospel here in Zambia, here in Luangwafera, um, where we can be unified as one, as one to make disciples of every nation um, and to uh, not only disciple them but equip them um, for the cause of the gospel and the kingdom.